Hey guys, I don't even have a video to do today. I'm just gonna do an extra one because I finally got my ND4 filter for my camera, which means that I can up the shit like crazy. And by up the shit, I mean create some blurring effects in the background um, more efficiently and everything is just perfect in the way I want it now. So all the settings are exactly the way they're gonna be, hopefully, for a really long time. The, the lens is new, the lens is the one I'm keeping. And now all I need to complete everything to, to complete the trifecta of everything. I have the ND filter, the lens, and now I'm gonna get my laptop on Friday and I'm super excited about it and none of this would be possible without my patrons on Patreon, so thank you so much. Today we're gonna to talk about the day that I got hacked. Um, on my Origin account uh, specifically got hacked, which is kind of silly because nobody gives a shit about Origin, right? Origin is like the electronic arts fanboy Steam, you know? And I fucking hate it. I hate the fact that there is anything other than Steam. I like to have all of my games that are on PC condensed onto my Steam account. I have like 355 or something games on Steam. And three, three fucking games on Origin. And the reason I'm even using, using Origin right now is because I am playing Unravel on my gaming channel. Uh, I'm in like 10 episodes in or something and I fucking love that game. I really wish I could have it on Steam, but since it's an EA uh, published game, you can't get it on Steam, you get it on fucking Origin, which is like, pfft, oh, dude, it's so fucking stupid. So anyway, uh, like three days ago, I wake up and I go to my computer. The first thing I do in the morning usually is just check my email and I'll just scroll through it. I won't actually like click on things unless it's like something I'm really excited about. Like right now I'm working on my own merchandise line and I was in bed this morning. I'm like, oh shit, the store's up. Ah! And it's not like 100% up because I made some changes, but that's neither here nor there. I just didn't want you guys looking around for a link for merchandise when it's not yet available to the public. My patrons have seen a little preview of it and I'm really excited. But anyway, so I was looking through my email and I see this thing about origin. Thank you. You've reset your password or some shit. And I'm like, what the fuck? I have not. So I go to my computer and I log into origin and lo and behold, I can still log in, right? So I go into my settings to change my password and I change my password, but then I go down and I want to make the two-step authentication happen because anytime I'm using a password that I will ever use anywhere else, I want to make sure that it's like safe and that no one has it and that no one can access any of the accounts just in case another account gets compromised. I don't want a, an account with like a similar password or the same password to get hacked because it doesn't have two-step authentication, if that makes any sense. People have tried to hack my Instagram quite a few times. Uh, people have like you know, uh, what's the thing where you can request a new password? People have done that, but they can't get through it because you have to have my fucking phone and my phone number in order to get into anything that I own. And that's how I keep my shit safe. Because if you guys haven't seen my scary hacker story, which I'll post in the description, I'm pretty crazy about keeping my social networks and all of my important things like PayPal and uh, my Gmail account very secure with two-step authentication, which is basically like anytime you log in, you get the code on your phone and then you type it in. I have it for Steam too. And um, so I go to set that up and what I need to do to set that up is I need to answer a security question. And the security question is in fucking Russian. Like what, how, why was this in Russian? I don't speak Russian. I've never fucking set up a, a stupid whatever number thing. I've never even done this, right? So like why the fuck is it in Russian and why does it exist? And I'm like, what the fuck right now? So I put in a ticket, but you can't put in a ticket until you prove that you own the fucking account. So I decide to call, or I had them call actually, and they called me and I was like, what the hell is going on with my account? Why the fuck is there some fucking Russian shit in my account? And why, if there is some Russian shit on my account, did they not change the password? Why did they allow me to get back in and see that Russian shenanigans were happening on my fucking account? Um, and he's like, oh, well, we can just set it to whatever the fuck you want it to be set to. And I'm like, oh, cool, you just trust me that I am the person that owns the account? Whatever. At least, thankfully, I am. So I tell him what I want it to be, something about, you know, my school or my family or my mom's maiden name or some stupid shit. And, um, I add, like, three more because I'm like, this is fucking ridiculous. And then I, uh, set up two-step authentication, which is gonna be really annoying because I only play Unravel, like, once a week for the videos. I've already uh, finished it on, on my own time, so it's not something that I'm hurrying to play. So I'm not playing it every fucking day, and it's not a huge game, so it's not going to be something that I'm logging into all the time. But when I do have to log into it once a week, I'm going to have to use this fucking phone two-step authentication, which is really annoying. And so I asked the guy, is there any reason, like, why this would be happening to me? Is there, like, uh, what could, like, possibly have happened? Is there, like, some kind of, like, site-wide compromise or anything that I've done? And he said, no, it's usually people who play first-person shooters or shooter games and the people hack in in order to, like, reset your fucking, um, KDR, right? 
And I'm like, what? Why would anyone want to like log in and reset my KDR? First of all, all I have is Titanfall and Battlefield 4 on my account, right? So, um, other than Unravel. And Rayman Legends, which is now, I have no idea where the fuck it went or whatever. Um, I haven't checked on that. I should probably check on that. Why is there only three games on my account? Anyway, so, um, wait. Is Rayman Legends on that one or is it on the other one? I know there's like... There's one more like game portal thing that, I, I don't know, whatever. So, um... I go, and because I was curious about the, the shooter thing, I go and I check my Battlefield 4, and my Battlefield 4, lo and behold, has been played a couple hours in the last 24 hours. So some guy fucking logged on to play Battlefield 4 on my fucking account, and I'm like, dude, really? And then I go to my friends um, section, and I don't have a following at all on this fucking uh, account. I don't, I only use it to play. I don't use it to like talk to people or add people. And I have two friend requests, and one friend, and this fucking friend is obviously Russian, so clearly this fucking asshole friended himself and then friended some other of his other friends and wanted to play on like a fresh Battlefield 4 account or something. And um, so yeah, that's the story of me waking up last week and being hacked on Origin and the ridiculous nature of it. I don't know if that was interesting or not, I just really wanted to try out actually making a video uh, with my lens set up all perfectly and everything looks so awesome. There's so much less post I'm gonna have to do now because the color is fucking vibrant and everything is wonderful and I've got a wonderful bouquet going on in the background which means the depth of field where I am super like perfect and then back there is super blurry. Well not super blurry because I wanted you guys to still be able to tell that I have Nintendo plushies and the subscribe uh, pillow and stuff but I'm just excited about it. Production quality is so amazing. I know you guys know this about me already, but just like improving things makes me so fucking happy. Streamlining everything and just making things better for you guys. Mwah! Thank you so much for making this possible. Obviously, nobody would find my Patreon if I didn't have subscribers and people watching my videos and people enjoying my videos. So even if you're not on Patreon, I owe a lot of this to you and I fucking love you so much. I will see you in the next video. I hope you enjoyed this and I hope I can make such a boring occurrence kind of interesting with my awesome personality. Oh. <laughs> I'll see you guys soon. I fucking love you. Mwah! Bye.